Good morning, family, friends, and supportive strangers. My name is Coach T, exercise science major, exercise science nerd, dancer, fitness enthusiast, movement enthusiast. Today, I'm going to be making a breakfast style pigs in the blanket. Turkey sausage wrapped in a flat pancake that I bake in the oven. So it's really, really good. It reminds me of old school cafeteria food, but like a good version. It's with Kodiak cake, so it has pretty high protein, 14 grams of protein. And then I'm going to use three sausage links. These are from Butterball, 60% less fat than pork sausage. A serving of three links, it has 11 grams of protein. So 11 plus 14, that's 25 grams of protein in one, it's like almost like a crepe and it's really good and then on top of that i'm going to use sugar-free syrup that only has 10 calories per two tablespoons so i'm about to use about two servings of this to dip it in and yeah it's really low calorie 190 calories from the pancakes plus yeah 90 calories from there so that's about 380 calories or 360 calories 20 calories from this so 380 I guess all together I just preheated my oven then I'm gonna cook the sausage and it's really simple so I'll show you how I mix the pancake mix put it in the pan and all that for the flat pancake and then I'll do a time lapse of everything else and yeah then I'll show you the end result and it's really good low calorie high protein you can have it with milk in a protein shake or just a protein shake by itself and it'd be really good for breakfast so yeah let's get started with the video all right so I have my target scale here this is going crazy it's twenty dollars at target or online and he's meowing for going outside so i'm gonna let him outside real quick all right i let boots outside so i have this in a spoon i'm gonna measure out 53 grams of this on my scale and that's one serving i'll probably do that in a time lapse because nobody nobody cares you know All right, and this is why we can't have nice things because I got pancake mix everywhere, but this is literally how it goes every single time. So now I'm going to add water and, yeah, look at my finger too. I'm going to add water and mix it and then it's gonna get that pancake consistency. I'm just gonna put it in a pan to bake in the oven. So I'll do a time lapse of me mixing the pancake mix. All right, so there's two other things I like to add to this pancake mixture to make it taste a little bit sweeter, and that's this Flavor God's buttery cinnamon roll seasoning. Just makes it taste really nice and cinnamony. I wouldn't say it's a cinnamon roll taste, but it is really, really good. And then stevia to make it sweeter without adding sugar. So zero calorie sweetener, naturally gluten-free food, vegan. It's just fake sugar. So I add both of those into my pancake mix and yeah then we're good to go all right so this is the pan i'm going to use to put the rest of that pancake mix in there i'm going to use some butter flavored cooking spray and spray it let's see if i can record and do this at the same time let's do this i know it's a lot and i've got butter fingers literally i'm gonna take this spoon out into the sink pour this all in there whip the rest of that up later so that's that that's the mix and i'm gonna head over to the oven and put that in there and it's just gonna bake in there for probably about five to ten minutes i don't really keep track of the time but once it looks like a pancake like you can tell to take it out so now i'm just gonna cook three of these on the pan just like you would cook any sausage zero calorie butter spray wherever it went somewhere right there zero calorie butter spray for the pan so i don't have any calories from fatty oil i'm gonna keep those sausages and then i'll show you how i wrap them and then It'll be good. I'm just turning on the stove now. I wasn't joking when I said I was gonna look this up. The shoulder though. Thank you. 
that is what they look like. I just need to get away from that sizzle and you can hear it very loud and clear. But that's what they look like. Now I'm gonna check on the, okay, it's still sizzling and I took it off that burner, but all right, it's still cooking. But anyways, now you can see what the pancake is looking like. Yeah, that's not even on a hot burner, it's just hot. And that's what the pancake's looking like. So I, I used a different pan last night when I cooked this for dessert and it was more flat, but this one is gonna be a little more round and I'll probably group the sausages together closer, but that's what it's looking like. It's pretty much almost done. I think that might even be done. It's kind of raised up a little bit, but yeah, that's the pancake. So funny enough, I had a slight dilemma and the pancake in that pan doesn't work as well because it makes it too thick. So I'm cooking it through some more and learned that you should use a thinner dish and not a rounded dish, you should use a pan. So whatever, I'm gonna cook the rest of this through so that I'm not eating uncooked weird pancakes and then I'll actually show the full thing at the end. All right, I have to admit, this ended up being a fail, but I did it on my store. When I did it last night, I did it in a flat pan, the brownie pan that was more flat and the pancake ended up really nice and flat. And I didn't think about how deep that pan is and how it would come out too thick and kind of unedible. So I'm probably still gonna eat that, but I don't wanna even show me trying to wrap it. Boots is crying outside for no reason. You wanna come inside? Change of light and it's kind of scary. But anyways, yeah, that is that is that video. This is a fail video now. The ingredients are all the same, just make sure you use a flat pan, not a deep dish pan. So it should turn out really good. I'm actually gonna include the clip from my story because then you can see what it's supposed to look like. And then you saw that trash. So that's it, hope you liked that video. I know it wasn't as planned, but give it a like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff if you wanna see more videos like these. The ingredients and all that is still good, it's just I messed up and I'm not gonna re-record, I'll show the real, I messed up, it's whatever. <laughs> I'm still gonna eat it, cause it's, cause it's still food and it's good. So that was that, and yeah, follow my Instagram if you'd like to see more things like this and my TikTok and all that. I also have a blog and that'll be listed here, boop. And yeah, other than that, I hope you have a great day, hope you enjoy this video, and I'll see you later, bye. This is what it ended up being. It's not bad, but low-key not cooked all the way through. <laughs> Hi, Boots. Boots, you want some? Boots. What's up, cutie? <laughs> Bye.